Welcome to Doug Does Stuff. I'm Doug and today we're talking boat trailer. Uh, we got this boat and the trailer um, a couple months ago. Going on a five hour trip um, this coming weekend and I figured I would, you know, change the bearings out just to be safe and sorry. Bearings, seals, and races because when I checked one, one of the seals was cracked. So I did that. Uh, I bled all the brakes. I put it all back together. I took it for a ride. Five minutes down the road, I checked it. Everything was good. Another five minutes down the road, checked it. All was good. Did 65 on the highway for a while. Pulled off. Checked it. I could still touch all the wheel bearings, uh, the hubs, everything. Got home. As I was pulling into my driveway, I noticed smoke. And I was like, what the hell? So I jump out of the truck. I go back. And this tire right here, whew, billowing smoke out of this hub or out of this area. Um... You could feel the heat just by getting close to it, let it cool down. I took off the tire. Um, the hub wouldn't turn at all. So I was like, oh, did I seize up the bearings? Did I not? I, I didn't know what I did. Um, I took a hammer and I tapped the brake caliper and it released and then I was able to spin it. So I'm uh, thinking that my, for some reason, the caliper froze. Now, Entirely possible because there's so much corrosion on this on this uh, trailer. Hold on, here's a truck going by. Um, I'm gonna pull you in here. Wait for him to go by. I took off. Well, you can see it right there. There's the offending caliper. I took off the other day all of the bleeders, and some of them were clogged up with like a white solid substance corrosion. Uh, so I I cleaned all those. I bled all the brakes. I used a pneumatic and one that hooks up to your air gun I pulled the uh, brake fluid through it and uh, I thought all was good and apparently not because that seized up well I can't take the uh, risk that one of the other three after I try and fix this uh, is not going to seize up somewhere in my five mile uh, five hour trip I got brand new tires all the way around I got brand new seals brand new bearings brand new races I got a brand new spare tire. I just pulled the trigger last night and from e-trailer, I ordered four new brake calipers. Um, they're supposed to be in tomorrow, which is Thursday. We're leaving on Sunday. I got to pull the boat out of the water. The marina is not going to enjoy if I try and pull it out uh, on a Saturday, especially a nice Saturday. They're going to kind of annoyed. So really, Friday is the day I got to pull the boat. So hopefully they come in tomorrow. Now what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna take off all the calipers. I'm gonna blow all of this, uh, all these lines out, try and push out whatever gunk might be in there. Hopefully, you know, there's nothing. Hope that wasn't the problem. But that that's the plan for today. But I do wanna show you, uh, as I, I got this up on jack stands, I'm gonna zoom out here. I'm gonna spin this. Now, this one is bouncing around. That's that because I only have two of the uh, uh, bolts on. But here's the rest. You can hear the brake kind of grabbing in there. Come to the other side really quick. I think I got the bearing set correctly. The castle nut. Hear that? That's the, that's the brake pad rubbing. So they spin nice, um, but like I said, I can't take the risk. So I am going to take the day, uh, or at least uh, maybe an hour, hopefully, and take off all the calipers and go from there. Hopefully I don't have to replace brake hoses, because if I do, this job is getting expensive, but I need to have a trailer that works. So stay with me, I'll fill you in afterwards. Like and subscribe, peace out.